Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel A Monk in Cloud. So I am Yashwant and I am your host reviewing Cloud Academy today. And a quick disclaimer here, I am not representing any company or an organization and this video is not sponsored at all. As you know that I have been selected to AWS Community Builders and one of the perk being an AWS Community Builder is to get free access to Cloud Academy right so cloud academy is owned uh, it is a you know a company that comes under a qa company okay so basically it will it is an one stop solution to learn cloud and devops skills right so uh, and dev skills also you can learn from aws azure and gcp to software development and data and you can stay updated to the newest technology and no, learn new skills and advance your career with modern tech platform right it is a paid subscription actually as a community builder you will be getting the access to cloud academy for an entire year completely for free right so i am just sharing my views and how this cloud academy is because i feel pretty happy about this platform because i have not used such a uh, you know premium platform so far in my career so i've been using you know uh, udemy courses or coursera free courses like that but this is one of an overwhelming perk that i'm getting as a part as part of uh, aws community builder and i have used this for around 10 days and i'm reviewing this in front of you right so if you see here uh, basically this will uh, this platform is built in such a way that it will keep track on your uh, skills enhancement if you you know add your goal if you set your goals here in this platform basically you will get the reminder on your calendar saying that you need to learn so at this particular time and what you have to learn everything will be set for you right so you can set that particular thing in this uh, cloud academy dashboard right again i'm saying this is not a sponsored video i'm just giving my honest opinion okay you can learn anywhere from aws azure gcp linux security uh, terraform infrastructure as a core tool you can also learn python ansible kubernetes devops and and other technologies also you can visit this site i'll make sure to give this site uh, uh, you know link in the description box below you can check that and if you are willing you can enroll for this also right so so these are uh, you know taught by some of the you know greatest minds in the world where they are working in the uh, content creation industry and, and the real cloud industries right so you can get exposure there and they also have their own uh, you know tech community where they discuss about uh, these events and and new things that are rolling out every day in the tech industry you can stay up to date with that right so uh, these are uh, this is about the site itself now if i go to my own personal dashboard if you see here i've been learning you know um, uh, scripting uh, shell scripting quite a lot of time on here uh, i've taken that course and if you see here from march uh, i have set the goal still um, one month so if i if i you know schedule here for the next uh, 30 days it will just keep on reminding me so that i need to learn so i can keep track of all those things right so that is the beauty of this platform and if you ask me what are the different courses or any uh, suggestions that i uh, if i want to give if you see here it is starting from amazon web services let me go and select amazon web services if you see here it will it will go and provide me the list of content that is already there on the amazon web services right so the paths are divided into uh, different things here. If you just want to watch the course, you can select this course. If you want to practice anything, you can just click on this hands-on lab and it will open up a lab for you and you can just start learning hands-on there, right? So hands-on skill is really important. Some people might not have, uh, you know, access to cloud uh, AWS or Azure or GCP, right? In that scenario, what you can do is you can watch a course tutorial at the same time after completing it, you can go for hands-on lab, right? And you also have lab challenges where this will not be guided. You will have to complete the lab challenges on yourself. Whereas hands-on lab will be guided. They will give guide you every step so you can, you know, complete that. And 
if you want to take some quizzes that is also available the quizzes are not repetitive if you take the quiz now and repeat the same quiz after some time the quiz questions will be different right that, that is another thing and if you are aiming for a certification you can also take some you know uh, preparatory level certification quizzes here on this platform which is nearly organized right so now let me if i go to courses here uh, it'll uh, divide the entire amazon web services uh, you know courses into different things if you see here uh, if you are just be beginner and uh, get starting with aws you can go with this track and you can learn about introduction to aws what is serverless computing uh, compute fundamentals and most popular things and if you just want to concentrate on security identity and compliance you can come here and you you can take up the course on this one right and if you are just wanting to learn storage related things like ebs cs3 and all you can come here and explore the courses option available for you similarly for database developer tools machine learning and analytics also right you can also take courses on management and governance like cloud formation cloud trail all those things are there networking content delivery compute and loads and loads of content are already available you can go through the course and you can take up the hands-on also now let me go to hands-on lab just to show you how it looks right if you see here first uh, lab that i can see is securing an aws uh, app sync api with amazon cognito so it is a four step so if i just click on this one right so it will give me the steps and and also how i can log in all the if i click on start lab right so i'll be getting the access to the amazon web service console like the access key and the secret key and all so i can just uh, you know go over and complete this labs right and also if you see here what are the learning objects you uh, intended audience and all those things are very well documented in case if you do not know about app sync first learn about app sync and then start the labs right firstly what i prefer is while learning a new thing first i want to build i want to go through the lab first and then start uh, learning about that that is how i learn so this is you know completely a great thing for me and if you also want to explore other options for example if you want to learn devops you can click on devops and you can see the different uh, options that is available for you right so if you see here hands on lab and all those things and a good thing is you can learn based on your job role path also for example if you are a cloud architect you can select this cloud architect and you can see uh, the path that is available for you for example let's say i want to become a devops engineer i select this devops engineer and here based on my job role path devops engineer starter devops engineer intermediate and devops engineer proficient right so this uh, it it is kind of a job itself for you. Uh, you you have to go through the course content and you have to clear some of the tests that is in there in between right for uh, the first one the starter if you see here 53 working days it will take if you spend three hours every day right so the second one is the intermediate one where you will be learning 58 uh, you, you would be dedicating for 58 working uh, working days and is 83 for the other one proficient right so you can take up uh, this devops engineer uh, you know path and you can start learning from here right so if you ask me i would rate 5 on 5 for this particular platform because this is really uh, made my life easier because if you are a, uh, if you are learning for if you are learning any of cloud or devops related content if you want to learn outside you will have to you know buy many courses but here in this platform everything is neatly organized and i can come here and i just have to search for the course and if that particular course is available i can just start uh, right uh, start that course right away right so that is how simple this platform is so i thought of reviewing reviewing it to you so if you're liking the content if uh, if you're uh, planning to take up the subscription for this uh, you know you know platform you can do that but try to get it for free by becoming an aws community builder right so that's how i aimed and i became a cloud uh, you know a community builder and i got access to this right so don't spend too much on the platforms and all um, there are a lot many uh, so course courses and tools that are already available on online on youtube and everywhere you can start looking for them also right so if you're liking the content that i'm creating 
please consider subscribing and share it among your friends thank you and i will see you in the next one